everyone, this is Maria, and with summer just around the corner, I thought it would be fun to share with you some ideas I came up with for a pet rock house you could take along with you on family vacations and road trips. These are just a few ideas to inspire you to create your own pet rock travel homes. So the first one I want to share with you is this cute little drawstring bag that I purchased in the dollar bins at Target. And so it was only a dollar, and these are super simple to open. You can see they're really easy, easy to close, easy to carry around with you on a vacation, even a day trip, you guys. And so I really like these. You can fit quite a bit in there. Your pet rock will travel comfortably. Let me just show you what I have in this one. And so I purchased some other things in the dollar bins because your pet rock may need a flashlight. And I thought these were so cute. And so you just squeeze right here and you can see it turns on so your pet rock won't have trouble seeing at nighttime and just super cute. I also have one, I believe that's a donut. Now your pet rock may want some snacks. So I purchased my pet rock, some pop rocks. These are strawberry flavor candy. And let's see what else I have in here. Here is my pet rock. And so she will travel in this little bag. We have some bubbles. I purchased these in the dollar bin. I believe there were three or four of these in one package for a dollar. So cute. And so your pet rock will have fun doing bubbles. You can have fun playing with your pet rocks too. And you may want to invite a friend for your pet rock because it's always fun to travel with a friend. And let's see what else I have in here. Oh yes, we have our pet rock pets because they want to go along too on vacation. We can't leave them behind, right? So that is one of the ways you can travel with your pet rocks is in this little drawstring bag. Now another fun and simple way for your pet rock to travel this summer is in this simple plastic storage container. I purchased this storage container at the Dollar Tree. They came two in a package and they also were sold in different colors. My pet rock loves pink. So I went ahead and bought this pink one and you can see I added a sticker here. Let me show you the booklet of stickers that I purchased at Michael's. And this booklet of stickers was a dollar. There's so many cute stickers here that you can use. You can even share them with your friends. So let me go ahead and open this up. Also, I wanted to show you the decoration on the side. So you can see we really didn't need to add too much decoration to this one. And so just put the lid there. And here is my pet rock. You can see she's really happy with her travel home because she's smiling. And she's taken a few of her favorite things along with her like this miniature Etch-a-Sketch, which she uses as an iPad so she can play her computer games. So I purchased the Etch-a-Sketch at Party City a while back, and so you can find it with all of the party favors. And she didn't want to leave home without her Slinky Dog. She loves her Slinky Dog. And my pet rock, this particular pet rock, is very active, and she loves sports, so she's going to take along this ball. She's also going to take her pink skateboard in hopes that she can ride this at a skate park. So while you're traveling, you want to make sure that your pet rock is comfortable. And so I've gone ahead and set this package of beads at the bottom of the container. And so she can rest right on top, just like this. And so that serves as a bean bag. Let me go ahead and show you the beads. So what I did was I purchased a package of pony beads at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. And I removed the header with the staples. I went ahead and removed the staples. And so what you're left with is a bean bag, just like this one. It's really pretty and colorful and your pet rock will be comfortable. So my next pet rock home is this coconut. And that's because my pet rocks inside are two pet seashells and they wanted something more exotic. They're thinking more along the lines of Hawaii. And so I purchased this coconut. It's a coconut cup at the Dollar Tree. And I also purchased these little ankle lays and you can see the larger lays. They came all in a package for $1. And so this was one of the ankle lays and I just put that right around the middle just to decorate it. This came with the coconut cup. And so what you do, you just pop off the top and inside we have some little miniature guitars that were party favors that I purchased, I believe at the Dollar Tree a while back. And so, but in this case, these are going to be ukuleles. 
And so because they are thinking about Hawaii and something more exotic, I know they look like guitars, but with a little imagination, they are ukuleles. And here is one of my pet rocks. She is so happy in here. And we have some pineapples. I think there's also another pet rock in here. Yes, there is. <laughs> I knew she was there. She was hiding and she's really happy too. They are so excited about going on vacation. Now we have some pineapples here and I purchased these at the Dollar Tree. These came on straws, a package of straws. And so you can have little pineapples that you could set right outside her little pet rock travel home. Inside, I went ahead and used these for cushions, you guys, just to make it nice and soft and comfortable for the pet rocks. And so I have this one right here that's a little bit larger than this one. And so all I did was tuck this right in here and I put this one right on top there. Isn't that pretty? And then you could set your pet rocks on top. And then if they want to play their ukuleles and you have your pineapples. Also, while I was at the Dollar Tree, I came across these really cute LED gel glass candles. They were just a dollar. And look at the little starfish inside and there's some seashells. And I've already opened one up, so let me go ahead and show you that. So here's the one that I've already opened. You can see how pretty it is. And it's got this clear gel. You wanna make sure you do not play with this. This is not wax, it's gel. And this is for decorative purposes only. It's not to be played with. And so my pet rocks will use this as an aquarium. And so let me go ahead and turn on the switch. There's a little switch down here. You can see the light. Isn't that pretty? It's so pretty and it would just look really pretty at night when my pet rocks are relaxing and playing their ukuleles. So I just love this coconut pet rock home. It is so cute and it just screams summer. So this pet rock home is super adorable and I just love it. It's a little piggy snack container that I purchased at Daiso Japan store. And so you just lift the ears up and they just snap open and then you lift the little face up. I wanted to mention I paid three dollars for this container. So cute and it lifts right up and then we have inside we have my little pet rock here. It's so cute. Her hair is a little messy because she's been just hanging out in her pet rock home. She's just trying it out before summer before she hits the road and so we also have a bed inside because again I want my pet rock to travel in comfort. And so I made this little pillow just out of felt. You can see the stitches back here. I just use a needle and thread. And so I added some little cotton balls inside, just two little cotton balls, just to make it a little fluffy and some ribbon around the edge. And so this is a little booklet here that came with this miniature Barbie that I purchased a while back, I think at Michael's. But you can take along your Pet Rock's favorite things. This just happens to be her favorite item. And so we are going to use this sponge as a bed. This is what's really soft and comfortable for her. This is what she chose. And so I purchased these sponges at the Daiso Japan store. I really love the colors on them, the patterns, and it's nice and soft. And on the bottom of this Pet Rock home, I just glued a piece of green felt. And so we have the felt for the flooring. We have the little sponge for the bed, a little pillow, a decorative pillow, for her to lay her head on and there she is right there she's just gonna hang out and she's got her little booklet and she's got her favorite toy her Barbie so cute I love this one so the next pet rock house I'm going to show you is this lunch box and so I purchased this lunch box this Snoopy lunch box at our local thrift store for one dollar again this could be something that you already have in your own home and so what I did was I just cleaned it up a little bit and let me show you what I have inside. This one also I want to mention is easy to carry because of the handle. And so what I used to decorate the inside of this lunch box are these stickers from the package of stickers I just showed you that I purchased at Michael's for a dollar. And this was super simple to decorate. It's so cute. I just love this. And let me go ahead and show you the rest. Okay, so the first thing I want to show you are the pet rocks that are going to be traveling in this pet rock home. So I'm just going to set them down right here. And so my pet rocks are going to be sleeping under the stars in these sleeping bags that I made out of these pot holders 
that I purchased at the Dollar Tree. These are super simple to make and I'll show you how to make them in another video. So these pet rocks wanted to take along their motorcycle and these pet rocks plan to eat outdoors quite a bit. In fact, I purchased this really cute pot holder at the Dollar Tree. There was two in a package. You can see it's just a regular pot holder, but you can use this as your barbecuer. And then I found these erasers in the dollar bins at Target, but you could find these little food erasers almost anywhere nowadays. And so you can just open these up and pretend to barbecue. I just thought this was so cute. You could set this on the table or on the ground and barbecue and set your pet rocks all around. It'd be so cute. I just love this idea. So now for the last pet rock travel home that I'm going to show you, and it's one of my very favorites. I purchased this decorative box with a handle at Michael's Craft Store. It was marked $5.99, but that day that I was at the store, it was 40 or 50% off. So I believe I paid between three and four dollars for this. It is so cute. It's pink, it's got polka dots, it's got artwork on the back. You could see the bicycle with the flowers. It says Paris forever. I just love this. And so I love this little handle. It's so cute and it's sturdy. I went ahead and added some beads here. This was just a bracelet that I purchased for the beads uh, for crafting a long time ago at the dollar store. So I just added that to it. So here's the inside of my Paris Pet Rock travel home. And so what I did was I hot glued some pink felt for some flooring here. I had this floral trim and I glued some of that down there on the felt and then I glued it all the way around on the bottom here on the lid. And then for the back here, I had this pink pom-pom trim that I purchased at Michael's. I just thought it was so cute and I just loved it and it's perfect for this box. Also, I had this postcard that I received with my junk mail in my mailbox. And so what I did was I just put it right in here. I just tucked it right underneath the pom-poms. I didn't even have to glue that in. So we're back to these pony beads here that I purchased at the Dollar Tree. And what I did was I just took the header off and then we ended up with the just the bag of beads. And then I had some of this duct tape with my craft supplies. And I really love this because of the Eiffel Tower. So let me show you what I did with it. I went ahead and covered the package of beads with the duct tape and it makes a really nice bean bag and somewhere comfortable for my pet rock to rest. I also found this coin purse at the 99 cent only store and it's so cute. It says Paris on here and it's perfect. And I only paid 99 cents for it. It has a zipper. So my pet rock can put some of her favorite things in here like her books because she loves to read. And also she's going to want to journal while she's on vacation. And there's plenty of more room in here for souvenirs. And while my pet rock is in Paris, she's going to want to paint some beautiful landscapes. And she'll need some pretty umbrellas when she takes those evening strolls along the Seine River. And she can hardly wait to go on picnics in the countryside. She'll also want to sip on cold lemonade on those warm summer afternoons. And while my pet rock is on vacation, she's not going to worry about calories. She's just going to enjoy all of the sweet treats that she can eat. And before she leaves on vacation, she plans to teach her own pet rock how to speak French. Au revoir. Thanks for watching everyone. I hope you have fun creating your own pet rock travel homes for your summer vacation and road trips. Have an awesome summer. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.